So hey, what's up guys? This side Ara when you're watching Atra Creators YouTube channel. So in this video, I will let you know about the MIUI Mint Room, which has been released two days back, and I'll be using it for a what do you say two days, and we're gonna full review of that. So if you are new to my channel, then please hit the subscribe button because it doesn't really cost you anything, but it really really motivates me to create an awesome content for yourself. So my name is Ara. This is Atria Creators YouTube channel. So let's get dig into the video. So guys, as if you can see in the about section of the device, here you get that processor written and battery, all the things had been written. It is running on the MIUI Indonesian UBI team and it is getting the MIUI Mint ID is 13.0.4. If you can click on the all specs, you get the 1GB expandable ROM in here. And if you click on the Android, you get that beautiful Android 12 Easter egg all around. I know that uh, no Android 13 for MIUI. And I think sooner will we get the, uh, what do you say, Android 13 support over the Redmi Note 10. But after that for Android 14, I don't think that Xiaomi uh, will give. But yeah, MIUI Mint team should give this. About from that, here is the ID of MIUI Mint. And you get the latest Android security update of, uh, what do you say, December 1st, 2022. Yeah, it's been January. But yeah, for now, this is the latest update. For all that, if you click on the detail specs, it will not open. I don't know why, but it will not going to open. About apart from that, first of all, I will let you talk about SIM cards and network. Been using the Geo SIM for a while uh, in this device. No issues that I have been faced on the call recording. What do you say? Uh, video calls. The video calls of Geo is also working fine in this room. No issues that I personally feel in this room. If you click on the Wi-Fi, still I am connected to a Wi-Fi and I am getting. What do you say? Proper speeds in the Wi-Fi, so no issues. And uh, some of a uh, few people people were asking me about what do you say? Hotspot. Let me help you to see that if I click on the hotspot and it will work. So don't think that the hotspot will not work on this room. Many of the rooms that that in that hotspot is not working fine, but in this device the hotspot is working fine. After that, you get the wallpaper and personalizations option. You have to click allow. And now from here, you can see that what you have here, you click the AOD and you can customize nothing. No new AOD has been added in this room, but you anyhow, you can, what do you say, manage it. And here you can select the icon, icon style, but uh, by default, there is the option of these icon style, but I don't know why the icon has been changed of this room. Apart from that is the all things that I have mentioned. And if you click on the library, you get the my wallpapers and here is the option of molten glass. What do you say? All the crystallizations and these all things were above here given. Apart from that, there's the option of themes and it will help you to get the, what do you say? Themes option and you will select from there and it is working fine. And these all were the font settings and effects option is also been there. But I generally like starlight, so I would enable that. Display option, you get that dark mode option also and dark mode is pretty fast and you can select more dark mode option per app. You can enable the dark mode. So it will help you to use that dark mode per app, which app do you want, but it will really nice to see that it is working in the brightness level. You can see that sunlight mode is even, but I don't know why sunlight mode what does because many of times sunlight mode doesn't works here like the saturated and yeah, this is working and you can select the what do you say uh, uh, color temperature from here and it is working fine and guys if you're still watching the video then please please subscribe because it doesn't really cost you anything it will help me to create awesome content like this and you can also follow me on telegram channel and do on twitter for more tech updates info apart from that uh, here's all the option is given always on display i already talked about that notification effect i already talked about Lock screen format, nothing much is here. And what do you say? The display section already talked about that sound and vibration. You get that sound effects and the sound effects. No Dolby Atmos support is there in the sound effects. So without any Dolby Atmos, you have to be with this room. No Dolby sound effect. It's and it will work with the earphones mode only. And vibrate on tap, but I don't think so that it is working because last update it is working fine but in this update i think it's not working i don't know why but it's not working in notification and center you can see that the same option is been there and the app notification notification style you can select these 
but it's so old and but this is uh, you can do that it will get changed and it is flawless no issues that you have to go to face in this thing you get the option of additional cards and in the additional cards you can check out that option is been there status bar option is there you can select this and it will frequently applied so yeah in terms of uh, what do you say fastness and smoothness the device is performing good we can't expect this kind of performance with the indian miui i don't know why but uh, they have decreased the animation speed and whatsoever things and this is a home screen option you get a bunch of customizations in the home screen option so you can do check out like here home screen you get that light mode classic and classic is working folds global app vault i have disabled because i don't like this app vault or something like stuff here you get the swipe up home screen option is there swipe up home screen to open search i disable i generally don't like that so i will disable that hide app i app icon is there you can hide and it is working and uh, generally you have to select the balanced with this animation speed you can see that so it will create a much faster and what do you say smoother effect on the device that you are using right now and you get that always show clock option is there but it is not working so don't think that it will work and yeah, here is a folded blur option is there complete blur but you can do that but i don't think so that you can use because it will work but it sometimes create a lag and apart from that system navigation option there icon size is when there and yeah icon size i think is better home screen layout is the bunch of home screen line now layout and if someone uh, like you you can you think that it will good then you can use that but it creates your phone like a garbage so i don't think and i can in recent like you can select like this cubic structure i personally like this and rounded task card you can see that rounded task card has been there so i like this here you can increase the recent task size and uh, what do you say you can uh, like two you can see you can increase that also and you can confirm this changes and apply also here blur app previews has been there reboot launcher if any work is not working it will just reboot the launcher and it will work fine here's the password and security option you get that fingerprint and it is working in the battery the battery is so good in this room i can't tell you that this device is charged what do you say uh one day back I mean yesterday uh, what do you say evening and you can see the battery usage and i have checked with the performance mode also and with the balance mode also and it kills the performance what is what sorry it is killer performance that it is opting to us apart from that apps option is there here you get the default apps or what do you say manage system apps and uninstall system apps is there but i have used many miui devices but haven't seen this option working so i don't think when miui is going to pull out this but yeah no issues in the language and input same thing is there here is the get memory extension only 1 gb is available for this device because this is a 4 gb device not much more is given and the quick ball is option special gestures option is there vg toolbox game turbo and the game turbo works i don't think in which game turbo it is but uh game turbo is working and this is all the what do you say account and you can check out nothing more new in that personally i like the look of this room and it feels super smooth you can see that transition effects stumble it is all the no not a new thing i know but it is working quite smoother and you can see that animations were pretty fast like i open open any app and what do you say open play store what do you say ha huh. this is the what do you say caller dialer and if you ask me about the, what do you say call recording and yeah you get the call recording option working with no any announcement of that so it is working apart from that you get the permission and whenever your call recording is done you get a notification of that also If you ask me about the camera the camera is NX camera with you get these all the options what do you say settings and here's got the full MIUI 
support of the camera watermark this is all this is too good for those who are repeatedly ask me for what do you see rx camera is there bro what where you can install without root and one thing i want to clear that without root you can't install nx camera over any custom rom or me i special edition rom here you click the picture quality thus nothing new has to be what do you say said by me 48 megapixel does working fine and if you ask me about what do you say 48 megapixel is working if if i click this picture and generally i open it from what do you say uh it took time and it is what do you say uh let me go to details and you get that 48 megapixel shot and yeah hd preview is there and you can see that 48 megapixel and the photo quality is super good so yeah the nx camera facility is working if you select on the video you get that 4k 30 fps and the 4k 30 fps is working all around fine i think it's too good to see and this is without any what do you say uh, let me go to back to settings and video encoder 22.64 and eis is by default enabled but when you click on the 4k 30 fps it gets disabled so and the pro mode is also been working apart from that i have took some benchmarks so i will show you first of all about the safety net status sorry for those who have to run the banking apps the safety net status seems to be failed apart from that those you considering uh, and to do benchmark and uh, uh, cpu throttling i have also took that screenshots and what do you see just one minute i will show you about that those things gallery here's the gallery and you can see those settings also above here and what do you see where it's had gone screenshots and this is a cpu throttling test for which is ran for 15 minutes with the performance mode enabled of the battery and you can see that it is 92% max performance and the 148 is max gips mentioned over here so yeah and this is the safety details already i have told about that device is not certified those who think that device is certified device is not certified and no why but in the last update is certified so guys if you can see that this is a uh, what do you say anti to benchmark i have took in the performance test and you can see that it got 269888 with the memory of the 48862 and the gpu score is 42015 but if i take without any what do you say performance mode of the battery the score has been increased with the 273000 it means that i am thinking i am taking all the roms Uh, without any issues there has been a what do you say bug virus uh, the performance mode of the what do you say device is not working fine it is giving opposing results so i think that that it is not working so you have to anyhow let that forgetted that the performance mode will work this is all for guys review and if you thinking about what do you say power menu power animation you can see that it is working and here is the volume panel layout and uh, if it would be the what do you say miui sr then you would mightly get the what do you say monet settings engine customization but if you are getting too much customization that it means your what do you say performance is getting pricked so yeah performance wise it is bad but thanks for all the views to my videos and if you really again like the video then subscribe like the video and I will meet in the next video. If you really like this detailed video of this MIUI Mint or any other custom ROMs, then you will comment down. And if you have any queries, you can also comment down. And the description box is feel free to open. You can go through and check out all the installation playlist also. So my name is Arul. I am signing you off. We'll meet in the next video. Till then.